That looks gay. <laughs> Quote. You are aware I'm gay. <laughs> you are aware I'm gay. What's that from? The office. I recognise it. But I only recognise it from the, you um, are aware the, Hitchman, I'm gay. The, the Hitchman group. You are aware I'm It's gay. the one where he goes. You are aware I'm gay. Hmm. Yeah, I just don't remember. I, I recognise it, but I don't remember from, from which bit. Hello, everyone. Welcome is to. Is it new? Ah, oh, is it extras? Maybe instead? Almost certain. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because it's, it's that when she lands him in the fact that he says about the other guys like quite camp. Yeah, yeah. And then he says, well, oh, oh, it's not, he's not too camp, and blah, blah, blah. And then the guy goes, well, you, yeah. do, you are where I'm going. Yes, that's right. It's definitely from that. The extras. Yeah. The extras. <laughs> the extras. <laughs> Office. The, the extras. life's too short and the Derek. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome to Food Review UK. My name's MJ. My name's Nathan John. Penison. Penison, did you say? Penison. And today we are reviewing, uh Kit Kat. Yeah, do I remember what flavour these are or do I need to Google it? Does it say chocolate or something? It's, uh, it's, I think it's cranberry and almond. Um, but it's, uh, or red, I think it's red currant and almond maybe. But there's the packet and it's, this is actually one of the chocolatey ones, but in a bag form. So, mm -hmm. you know how we did the chocolate so, ones? So yeah, so obviously they're just fancy, fancy ones. Oh, fancy Kit Kats. Oh, it's just it's one fun. finger. Not going to satisfy anyone with one finger, are you? These guys. They're breaking boundaries. They're, they're tight. It's 39 is calories. It, is though. it shorter as well? Yeah, maybe. It doesn't look quite as. Doesn't long, does it? it? Oh. It's dark chocolate. Wow. Mm, not sure. Yeah, it looks like it. It all looks somewhere in between, doesn't it? Look at the uh, top though. Layered. Very interesting. Okay, here we go. Mmm. Dark. But not super dark. Mm hmm Like 20% or something. Yeah, 20% I think. Mmm. Nice texture. You got the, the berries are like little chewy bits. Mm-hmm. You don't really get any chewy bits. It's just got sort of a bit of graininess from that actually. Do um, we need another one? Yeah, I think so. I think all of them. I think all of them. Mm. Quite nicely, um, there is a slight bit of fruitiness there. Mm, yeah, yeah. Can't really pick up what it is other than berry. Mm, yeah. Or there's not enough there to get much flavour out of it. And because of its dark chocolateness, that sort of overpowers any real mm. notes. The almond is quite small in there, but it actually does surprisingly come through at the end quite nicely. Nice little that nuttiness. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. I think that's as dark as I'd want to go. Um, I'm not the biggest fan of dark chocolate. I really like that. Yeah, definitely. I actually like that a lot more than the other kit, kit we had earlier. Wow. Um, yeah, no, I'm. I'm <clears throat> I really like that actually. Yeah. The more I'm thinking about it, the more I'm liking it. Um, I think I would give it an extremely, extremely low five. Um, I really like that, and I agree. I'm not the biggest fan of dark chocolate. I don't mind it. I'm not offended by it. I'm not. I can. I can definitely. Eat, but for something like this, I wouldn't want that chocolate to be any more a higher percentage of darkness. Fair. Nice balance. Yeah, very nice balance. Um, I would give it a very solid four stars. Good. It's a really nice product. I got it from Candy Sam, by the way. Uh, not sure if they're still in stock. There might be their Kit Kat stuff's pretty good. They usually have quite a lot of Kit Kat stuff on there. Um, and yeah, yeah, really tasty. And also the packaging design mm. is excellent. Some of the um, Japanese Kit Kats can look quite samey on the packaging. Yeah. Um, but this looks very different. And um, yeah, that's really nice. Once again, it just points out why it's so miserable to be in this country when it comes to Kit Kats. Yeah, because they release a new one in Japan seemingly every other week. Oh, you like any other flavour that's not Kit-Kat? We'll just throw it with a Kit-Kat, don't worry, we'll, you'll get there. In the UK we get just to deal with the, the normal ones that we have every year. Um, what was the last 
Uh, the most recent new Kit Kat product is actually a new one. Uh, it's the Kit Kat Bites peanut butter flavour. Right, okay. Yeah, which I haven't found yet. I would like to try. The peanut Bites, the little, the, the, the bad things. Yeah. yeah but yeah. in terms of like a normal Kit Kat. Oh, like, oh God. Obviously they did um, like the, the coffee one from Brief. Toffee the, Tree was probably... The cappuccino one or Mocha, what was it? Mocha? Um, yeah, I think it was I think Mocha. The top of, what was the Toffee, toffee Tree? Toffee Tree was before. before. I think, but yeah, but they again, were, limited edition. Yeah, gone. they're about. What? I would imagine these are around for quite a while. Oh yeah, I mean, and these are dime a dozen. Not although it's Kit Kat, not dime. So, thank you very much for watching Food Review UK, everyone. We appreciate your support. Do subscribe to our other channels, which includes the life of Michael Jameson and Michael Jameson comedy, for more hilarity like this. Sounds Hit Tube presents royalty free sounds. Oh, this skirting board is dusty. I'm going to dust it. Goodbye. Goodbye.